Lorraine Kelly, 62, and her husband, Steve Smith, 62, have been married for three decades, but when her 50th birthday rolled around, the TV presenter got nervous that her husband didn't know about her dislike of diamonds. In 2010, Lorraine was celebrating the milestone birthday when Steve noted he had a surprise for her, leading her down a street of jewelers. The TV presenter went on a celebratory trip to Edinburgh with her husband to mark her half a century. In Edinburgh, Steve turned to Lorraine and said, I've got you a surprise. He then led her down a little street lined with jewelers, much to Lorraine's absolute dismay. Speaking on the How to Fail podcast with Elizabeth Day, the media personality recalled the gift that turned the moment from dread to delight. She said, We went down this little alleyway thing and there was a lot of jewelers and I thought oh no he's commissioned a piece of jewelry. No, right next door is this man who makes giant six feet tall penguins. He bought me a penguin of my own that's in our garden looking out onto the river. It's so unbelievably cool. Lorraine claims she doesn't understand why people love jewelry and diamonds. She added, diamonds are just carbon I've never understood it. Penguins on the other hand are a great delight for the morning talk show host. In fact, when Lorraine and Steve were celebrating their 25th wedding anniversary they went on a romantic getaway to Antarctica. Don't miss, Lorraine shared, we did the Shackleton voyage and I was crying. So many penguins. I just sat there and they come up to you because they're not used to people. It was a joy, it was the best, I can't wait to go back. The revelation came about as the pair were talking about Lorraine's unique house which is a renovated boathouse, not to be confused with a houseboat. Lorraine called it a strange, wee house that's had biddies added to it over the years. Talking about her decor choice, the journalist Syed, nothing really goes. It's all over the place, it's very eccentric. I've got stuff everywhere. I'm a terrible hoarder like my gran. I've got penguins everywhere, piles of books everywhere. It's a mad house, 